hate it when they scold me. And I hate being yelled at in my spare time even more. I've had it. Everything could just fall apart for all I care. Day after day. That was what I thought. As we have already reported, today at 3.45 p.m., a massive earthquake occurred centered in the Kanto region. The quake's epicenter was in the northern area of Tokyo Bay, at a depth of approximately 25 kilometers. The scale of the earthquake is estimated a magnitude 8.0. Please be aware of aftershocks and possible tsunamis. Onazawa? Mirai Onazawa? Yes. Okay, next, Kato? Yes! Hiroko Kato? <laughs> Kubo? Mayumi Kubo? Yes! So what are your grades? Komiyama, I'm Kimilko, sunk. Komiyama. You, Mayu? In the same Me boat. Me too! There's no way I can show Kimilko, this to my Saito. parents. They're so strict I can kiss my summer vacation goodbye. Lighten up, Yuka. There's no parent who doesn't love their kids. Have you met mine? Wow, you're going to the Caribbean? Yeah, they said they're taking it easy this year. Where's your vacation house, Risa? Canada. Daddy built a log house there. Wow. Hey, why don't you come over tonight? Mom's going to be baking us a souffle. Sure, I'll come. Magu, you're so lucky you live close to school. Hmm? So where are you going for summer vacation, uh, Onozawa? Uh, oh, we don't have any plans like that. I see. Well, you should go someplace cool, then. This year looks like it's going to be a real scorcher. Yeah. <laughs> okay, as for your homework over summer break, I was thinking I'd like a future report where you imagine yourself ten years from now. Please use your vacation time to really think about that, okay? Okay! okay. So what are you going to write about? For my future report? I have no idea. You'll be a pianist, <laughs> Yuka. You're all set. I like playing the piano, but that's not an easy life. Still, it may be nice, as long as you're doing something I'll I like. Say. But I don't even know what I like or what I want to do. Me neither. Hey, want to head over to Shibuya? Good idea. Mirai, no. you can too. I can't. My parents are working today. They have to watch the house. Tomorrow's summer break. Well, it's not like I'll be having much fun. There's nothing I especially want to do. Hmm. Uh, I need to trim these bangs. They're getting annoying. have any special dreams for the future. All I'm sure of is I don't want to grow up to be like that. That won't be me in 10 years, will it? Telling him. <laughs> Onosawa. So, how's middle school? Hmm. Nothing special. It has to be better than that. But it really is nothing special. What are you guys doing after school? Oh, it's a favor for Yuki. The marionette tree dad got me won't grow big at home, so I brought it to school. Teacher said I could plant it over there. Hmm. I know. Sis, you help too. Huh? Good idea. Isn't it? No way. Ow! Oh, I'm dripping wet. It's good to work up a sweat once in a while. Says who? Now it'll grow big. Yeah, thanks, Itsuki. <clears throat> Let's come and water it during summer break. Right! Let's go home, Yuki. Yeah! 
You said we'd play soccer after this was planted. Oh, that's right. Huh? Uh. Oh my god. What is with him? Ugh. Mirai? Oh, you're home. Say I'm home when you walk in. I thought you were a burglar. I'm heading out. I've got clients waiting. There's cake here. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> Hyping it up much? I have to get going. Share that cake with Yuki, okay? Aren't you having any? Mommy's on a diet, dear. Wedges! You should have gotten a round one. Mm -hmm. Oh, and you better have bring in the laundry, won't you, Mirai? It looks like rain. What? Wash your plates after you have your cake. Then wait for an express package and groceries from the co-op. Get the produce in the fridge as soon as it comes, okay? Okay, I'll be back sometime around 7. See you later! And leave your report card out. I'll look at it later. Like I care. After all that stuff you told me to do. What's that? For mom! For her birthday! <laughs> to mom, happy birthday. Boring. Boring? Nah, I guess it's okay. What are you giving her, sis? Uh, um, nothing special. Well, why don't we both give this to her? You drew it, you give it to her. Uh. There's cake. Want some? <laughs> it's good, huh? Boring. Would have been better if we could eat with Mom, right? But Mommy has to go out. Share that cake with Yuki. Mommy's on a diet. <laughs> you sound just like her. Do it again. <laughs> and what's wrong? You're still such a little kid, Yuki. Huh? Darn it. I wanted to eat a round cake. How can you not know that birthday cake is supposed to be round? Uh, this, this is awesome! <laughs> Wait, I'm super busy right now. The cell phone appears. I'm home. <laughs> ah, it's cool in Welcome here. Welcome home! Hmm? Where's your mom? Not home yet. Oh, well, I'll take a shower then. Did you remember? Today is mom's birthday. Yeah, so it is. Uh. <laughs> ah, that feels better. Hey, hey, don't leave things lying around. Put those away. So, summer break starts tomorrow. Yeah, you should get your homework done as soon as you can. That's not what I meant. Aren't we going somewhere on vacation? Everyone's always exams, exams. We never go anywhere. Well, that's true. <gasps> Why don't we ask your mom about that? No way. She gets mad over nothing all the time. Because she's busy with work now. Well, maybe she's due for a vacation. Got to buy milk. Hi, dear. What about dinner? Eating it up right now. It's after eight o'clock. <sighs> it's not like I can help it. I work too, you know. No, it's just the kids are hungry. So? I said I'm making it now. Oh, would you cut that out? Dad, don't blame it on us.
What are you looking so down about? I didn't give her my present. Why are you always so worried about them, even though you're just a kid? So are you, you know, sis. Don't you want mom and dad to get along? That'd be nice, right? At this point, they can do what they want for all I care. Huh? <sighs> what are you up to? Not a thing. Got a look at my future report. Got surprise lecture about how I had to go to college first. Same here. Got lectured about not missing piano lessons. Sucks. So, what is it that I want to be? My name may mean future, but I have no idea what mine is. So hot. Uh, morning. Mm. See you. <laughs> Bye. Please, Mom! You, John, don't be selfish. I have work to do. It can't be helped. So why can't Sis and I go by ourselves? By yourselves? <gasps> huh. Uh, what? Huh? A robot exhibit? They're holding it over at Odaiba. Do me a favor and take him, Kay? I don't want to go see some stupid robots. Besides, why do I have to play nursemaid for Yuki? But... What's the big deal? You're on summer break. You said you wouldn't give up your precious time for summer classes, so I know you're free. All right, fine. You want me to take him? I'll take him. <laughs> Sis, look at the bridge! Mm-hmm. We came here once before. Look! All right, okay, geez. <laughs> now arriving at Daiba. Daiba. Oh, oh, Daiba. We have to get off. Huh? Uh, oh. Uh, sis, let's take the boss. We got off too soon because you kept going on about Odaiba. Deal with it. It's hot. No, it isn't. Sure is hot. <sighs> let's go. This? This is what you wanted to see? Mm-hmm. You don't? Okay, fine. Come on, let's go. Uh. Uh. Oh, oh, oh. Sis, you look! You can pet them! <laughs> oh, it's so cute! Kitty, paw! Give me your paw! You can operate over there! These are quadruped robots designed to move by crawling. Their four legs can adjust to uneven terrain, allowing their operation on the rough ground of a disaster area. <laughs> its mobility can be used by rescue teams in their operations, and its radar system can find buried it's survivors. Awesome, sis. Give it a try! Its onboard electromagnetic search radar can detect the respiration oh. of an immobilized person from 5 meters away. The range <laughs> can be extended to 8 meters if they can move even a little bit. <laughs> Look at it go! Hey sis, don't be so rough with it. Ew, it's fine. Hey, are you going to be there all day? Could you hurry up?
Thanks a lot. Come on, sis. Why don't we go buy Mom a present for her birthday? Huh? Never mind about that. For starters, if she'd just brought you herself, then I wouldn't have had such a rotten day. She looks down on me because she thinks I'm a kid. But... For another thing, I don't have any money. I do! I have some! Huh? <laughs> Which one should we get, sis? Hey, how about that one? Uh, that's a popular one. Oh, you don't say. <laughs> it's nice to get something like this once in a while. Huh? Uh. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want this? Uh, uh, no. Sorry. Here. Take it. It's too flashy for my grandma anyway. That's okay. Take it. I insist. <sighs> really, it's okay. Um, how about this one, sis? This one's nice, too. Uh, Getting somebody a present? Yeah. It's our mom's birthday. Oh, that's sweet. I'd definitely cry if my daughter gave me this as a gift. Uh, thanks a lot. Hope your mom likes it. Uh-huh. There's a lot of people today. Be careful you don't get lost. Bye! Don't treat me like a kid. Come on, sis. Let's get this one. Mom likes flowers. Buy what you want. <clears throat> sis, I gotta go to the toilet. So go. Here, hold this for me. Oh, <clears throat> after you're done, buy us a drink. I'll be outside. Mm -hmm. Sure. So hot. <gasps> hey, you mind not stopping in the entrance? <laughs> oh, I've had it. Why is everything trying so hard to piss me off? <sighs> day after day, everything makes me angry. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> what is it with that face? <sighs> I wonder. Is anything good going to happen in my life? I've had it. It's all such a pain. The whole world can fall apart for all I care. What 
do I do? started a fire in that section. Now get out through the west entrance. But, but I, I have to... Oh. A quake. Close one, wasn't it? I guess that's what they call safe by a hair. Thank you very much. Aren't you the girl I just. Oh. Can you stand? Is You're alone. All right? the exit's this Where's your way. little brother? Hurry! I let him go to the restroom by himself. What about your dad and mom? Mm mm. My brother and I came here by ourselves. I have to find him. Oh. Ah! Oh. You're a good sister. Oh. I, I let him go to the restroom by himself. Did you look there? But he was gone. His name? Huh? What's your brother's name? Yuki. Yuki? Yuki! Well, come on. Let's find your brother. Incredible. Oh, Yuki. Excuse me. Huh? 
Have you seen a little boy by himself? He'd be about seven or eight. Uh, I have seen boys, but they were all with their parents. Sorry I can't be of any more help to you. No, that's okay. Thanks. Excuse me. Have you seen a little boy by himself? About this tall, maybe seven or eight? Hmm. Excuse me. He was wearing a pea green t-shirt. It had a line going across his chest. He's my li my little brother. Oh. I'm sorry. I haven't seen him. I saw a few boys down in the toy shop on the first floor, but... You did? Thank you so much! Uh, wait! <laughs> Let's look for another stairway. This one seems too dangerous. <gasps> no! Come back! Wait! anything that reckless again, will ya? You know how dangerous that was, don't you? But Yuki's in the toy shop! I know! But what's the point if you get yourself hurt too? If I get hurt too... Well, don't say that! You don't know that Yuki's hurt! You don't know that he's hurt! Stop! It's dangerous that way! Stop! No, let me go! I'm sorry. I shouldn't have spoken to you that way. Your little brother's all right. He's all right. I'll help you find him. Just stop being so reckless. <laughs> Yuki! 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 We've almost got it. Okay. Lift. Yuki! Okay? Is anyone hurt? We're fine. Please, this place is dangerous. You should both evacuate quickly. Please, we're looking for a little boy. He's wearing a pea green shirt. Uh, <sighs> we've searched the whole place already. This child is the last one. The rest are... Sister, let's get out of here. It's dangerous here. Come on, while the smoke isn't too thick. No! Go by yourself if you're leaving! I won't leave Yuki behind! Then consider this. Can you afford to let yourself get killed? If Yuki's alive, he's trying to get out of here too. That's why you mustn't die. Stay alive. And you'll find him, right? <laughs> Yuki! Oh, after your
you're done. Buy us a drink. Oh, a drink? Hey, wait! Where are you going? Just let me check in here! It's dangerous here. Let's keep moving. A fire? Hey, Yuki. Maybe we can stay out of the rain here. Right. <sighs> Thank goodness. <laughs> yeah. Can't get through? Hmm. No luck here either. The relays in Omoda were probably destroyed. To repeat. Today at 3.45 p.m., approximately four hours ago, a massive earthquake occurred centered in the Kanto region. The quake's epicenter was in the northern area of Tokyo Bay at a depth of approximately 25 kilometers. The scale of the earthquake is estimated at magnitude 8.0. A magnitude 8? Please be careful of aftershocks and possible tsunamis. We can watch it on Due here. To the effects of the Your quake, phone all works? services within the city have been halted. According to the Tokyo Fire Department, large-scale fires have broken out in all sections of the city. Residents I are being urged if to evacuate. Dad and Mama, okay. you are evacuated, Where do you do live? Close by? by Near Kunuta Park? Primary traffic rules oh, are around Seiji. Uh -huh. I live in San Damn it, I can't center. get through it all. The, the only thing working is the one side network. Route Let's wait a little longer and see well what develops. They may give us an idea about how we can all get home. Why are you being so nice to us, anyway? I don't know. Because it's human? Or some such? <clears throat> Your big sister here went half crazy trying to find you. She's a good sister, huh? <clears throat> Thank you! We have to get you home soon so you can give that to your mom. Uh-huh. Uh, I just realized... I still haven't told you my name. I'm Mari, Mari Kusakabe, and you're Yuki, and... Mirai Onozawa. Oh, Mirai, huh? That's a good name. I don't like it much. Well, I like your name, sis. It's pretty. Oh. You're in middle school? Seventh grade. How about you, Yuki? Third grade. Coming out here all by yourselves. You must be very close. Not really. It's all our mother's fault that this happened anyway. Everything with her is always work. She's the one who told me to take him here. <laughs> That's kind of harsh, isn't it? I live at home with my mother and daughter. But I work so much, I hardly have time for my little girl. She loves to play on swings, so she said she wants me to work hard so we can move to a house with one. But if I don't hurry, 
She might end up too old to sit on a swing. That's right. I have a little something to get. I left it on my bike near here. Hmm. That woman might not come back. Is she? She left us here. She doesn't have any obligation to take care of us. Mm. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> it's okay. Huh? They're called aftershocks. You get a bunch of them like this after a major quake. That was a little one just now. I'm sure we're safe here. By the way, are you two hungry? I've got some cake, so... <laughs> Ta-da! Whoa. Well, it still tastes the same, right? Uh... Birthday? Mm-hmm. Today's my little girl's birthday. She just turned four today. Hina. Yeah. Okay. Here you go. Uh, thank you very much, Mari. It's great! <laughs> Even though it's a mess. But it's round. Hmm? hmm? Birthday cake should always be round. It's like a rule, you know? You're right. What are we supposed to do now? Good question. For now, let's get some sleep. I have a feeling tomorrow's going to be a busy day. Isn't a dream. It'll be all right. If worse comes to worst, we'll go home on our own. <laughs> oh, that's right. Maybe I can get through on my phone. <sighs> no luck? Not a bit. I hope... I hope that Mom and Dad aren't hurt. They're okay, right? Right? Right, sis? Do you think Mom and Dad are... I don't know! I can't get through! And I told you, don't ask me all these questions, okay? Uh, okay, <sighs> you two. I'll bet you're hungry. You get cranky when your stomach's empty, huh? Here, breakfast. Thanks a lot, Miss Mari. Just call me Mari, Yuki. <laughs> oh, ice balls! You can eat some if you like, Mirai. We've got drinks, too. Why, why do you have these? I remember that some convenience stores give out food during emergencies, so I went to check that out. You weren't here when I woke up, so I thought you'd left us here. Oh, 
You got lonely because I wasn't here, didn't you? You thought I'd run off. Uh, not really. It's just... Okay, let's make a promise. A promise? Mm-hmm. From now on, no more going off on our own. No one leaves the group without saying where they're going. Mm-hmm. Why are you doing all this, being nice to us? Huh? I mean, you have a kid waiting for you at home. If you didn't stay with us, you'd get back to her faster. Yeah, that may be true. But my home's in the same direction as yours. And maybe that's some sort of fate. So, let's go where we're going together, okay? Mm hmm Are you sure? We'll just slow you down, you know. Here, oh. eat this. Hunger breeds pessimism. You're just not happy when you're hungry. <laughs> Smile and attack the day. Come on, let's eat. Hmm, Umiji's so plump. Thanks you for the food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What'd you get? I got salmon. <laughs> Man, is it hot. Whew, boy. Today's gonna be a real summer scorcher. I'll bet it's over a hundred. You talk like an old man. Oh? I get that a lot. Mirai, you are way too direct. C cut that <laughs> out! <laughs> Give up? Hey, sis, I'm thirsty. Uh, here. Thanks a lot. No prob. I'm really glad I asked you to buy that yesterday. Okay. Let's see if there's been any news. Since we'll drain the battery if we watch for too long, we'll have to take a peek and then shut it off. Got it! I will now repeat the latest quake damage report for the Tokyo metropolitan area. All transportation services have ceased operation, with no restoration of service seen in the near future. Primary traffic restriction rules are in effect, and all traffic has been banned within the boundary of Tamagawa, Route 246, as well as the number 7 Loop Road. The confirmed death toll stands at 843, but with countless others either missing or gravely injured, that number is expected to rise. In addition, the sections of the city where fires have started continue to burn despite oh goodness, efforts so to bring them under dead. control. The fire department has asked that anyone near these fire zones move to a shelter area as quickly as possible. Currently, a large number of quake victims are walking back to their homes. We now turn to Professor Noriaki Murata of the Keihan University Disaster Research Center for more information. Well, we are looking at upwards of six and a half million people trying to make their way home due to this near-field earthquake in Tokyo. Related to that, uh, how long do you think the aftershocks will continue? We may possibly be seeing them for the next three days up to level five on the Shindo scale. Those making their way home may... I guess everyone's walking. No telling when the trains will start running again in this situation. Come on, sis, let's go! Let's try walking, too! I feel a lot better now that I ate that rice ball. But we live in Setagaya. It's so far. Doesn't seem like walking distance at first thought. Are you serious? Odaiba's cut off? The bridge is on fire and the roads are blocked all over the place. This place will sink. We're in real trouble here. It's okay. This land isn't in any danger of sinking, okay? But... I've heard that Odaiba's reclaimed land. Hey, there's shade over here! Daddy! I'm worried. We don't have any food or water. What are we going to do? Relax. There are people who live around here. Help will come soon. You're right. Let's be glad that the whole family's together, at least. Let's! I miss them. Our dad and mom. Shall we try to walk it? Uh -huh. You want to get back to your dad and mom as soon as you can, right? Uh-huh. Uh -oh. This is the Coast Guard. 
We are transporting quake victims via water bus. Anyone wishing transport from Odaiba to Hinode Pier, please assemble at the pier in Rainbow Park. Those wishing transport to the Chiba side, okay. please assemble Looks like in front of Okay, looks like we take a boat to Hinode Pier. Okay? I never should have worn these sandals. They're giving me blisters. Oh, let me see. Oh, that looks painful. Hang on. One thing you always carry when you have a child. Band-aids. Ah, look at that! They've got frogs on them! This is a certified frog worlder! Frog worlder? E enough! You don't have to tell her that stuff. But thanks. I'm happy to use them. Be my guest. You're lucky! <laughs> Think you can walk now? Yeah. I see. Well, if it comes to it, I can carry you piggyback. Ricket! Piggyback! <laughs> Don't be stupid. I'm not a little kid. Still, if you have any trouble, tell me. Seriously, I would carry you. I'm pretty sure my legs can handle it. <laughs> it's okay, I'll walk by myself. Okay, that's the spirit. Well, shall we go? Your feet doing okay? We're not in any big rush. Don't push yourself. I've been wondering, will we really get on the boat? Look at all these people who want to get on too. Huh? We won't get on? Why don't we go and see first? Come on, I'm sure it'll be fine. You're an optimist, aren't you, Mari? Well, more like I'm positive. Hmm. so much. We're almost to the pier. Right. Mari's so nice, isn't she? More like she just likes to butt in. <sighs> Sorry about that. Yeah, didn't you just promise that you wouldn't leave the group without telling us first? What happened to all that? Busted. I'm really sorry. No! It's okay! You did a really good thing! Everyone headed for Big Sight, keep moving straight. Those boarding the boat for Hamamatsu Cho, make a left at the intersection straight ahead, please. Wow, this is getting really messy. This is the only place to go for people who want to go home before the trains start again. <gasps> so we don't get split up. Mm -hmm. Mirai, give me your hand too. Uh, uh, I'll be fine. I told you, I'm not a little kid. Then keep close. Don't get separated from us. You got that?
Out of the way. Keep moving. Yuki? Mari? Where are they? Hey! Don't just stop here! They're no! All... Mari? <laughs> We're here, sis! Yuki. I think you better hold my hand. Don't let go of my hands. Uh-huh. Wasn't it? I can't believe the expressway collapsed. <laughs> What's wrong? Are you okay? <laughs> Screw that! We'll never get across the bridge! Damn it! That boat's the only way! Move it! Not hurt. Mm -hmm. Can you walk? Let's go. This vessel is going to switch over to sea rescue operations. Please board the water bus immediately. Do not board this vessel. Hang on to my hand no matter what. <laughs> you too, Mara. will be departing soon. Please give priority to the weak and injured. So many people. Maybe we should take the next boat. Let's just give it a try, shall we? Those who wish to board, please wait for the next boat. No luck. <laughs> you, kids, there! Get aboard, quick! Uh, uh... You too, Mom! Move it! <gasps> R right! You okay? Please, wait for the next boat! Calm down! Be careful! This is awful. Yeah, this isn't exactly an ideal situation. Still, we got on the boat, didn't we? You've got a lot of nerve, don't you? The guy calls you mom and you're all like, right, let's go. <laughs> I guess I have gotten tougher since my husband died. It hasn't been easy for me since then. Even though I'm alone, I guess I just want to try to bring up Hina well. Look! The bridge! It's still on fire. I see that. Looks like a tanker truck's burning.
been on that boat then. <laughs> Mari, you... I'm sorry for putting you in danger like that. Mm -mm. Thank you, Mari. Status report. We're on the move with the fire department initiating rescue operations. Relief supplies are being distributed in Shiba Park by the city of Tokyo and Monado Ward. Please follow the directions to Shiba Park. If you're injured, please remain here. You repeat, relief supplies are being distributed in Shiba Park. Have they arrived? The no, next boat. It should be right in about five minutes. Shiba Park is about 15 minutes away. Mirai, are all your blisters all right? Yeah. Okay then. Shall we get going? Right. Yesterday, at approximately 3.46 p.m., a major earthquake occurred, centered in the Kanto region. The epicenter was in northern Tokyo Bay, at a depth of 25 kilometers. The strength of the quake is estimated at magnitude 8.0. Sis, I can see Tokyo Tower! We're close to home now, right? I said we're not. But we can see Tokyo Tower from home! Even so, home's still far away. Uh, uh. Mirai, are you okay? I... I'm fine. Um... I'll be able to wash up at the park when we get there, won't I? Hmm. They'll have toilets, but I don't know if the water's running. Did you get dirty somewhere? Uh... Oh, no. Oh, yeah! Sis, when we get home, I'll let you have my pudding. Why would you bring that up now? Because you're trying so hard. Look, I'm not some little kid who needs snack time. Liar! You're like Sergeant Snack Time! Sergeant Snack Time? Yeah! <laughs> uh, I might be in trouble here. Uh, Mirai, do you have a stomachache? Uh, I'm fine. Didn't I say to tell me when you're hurting? Uh, hold on. I'm gonna check something. Are you hungry, sis? When we get home, let's go to Grandpa's place in Hokkaido. We can get soft serve or even... We're not uh, going uh, to Hokkaido this year. <sighs> Dad told me. Hey! Sorry I took so long. Sorry, Mirai. Did that cake upset your stomach? Uh, um, no, it didn't. Here. Portable toilet. <laughs> what? This is a toilet? Let me see! Whoa! It's made out of paper! Check this out! <laughs> Just say when you need it. You can use it anywhere. Um, I'm good for now. Oh? A portable toilets and wet wipes here! Portable toilets and wet wipes here! So many people. Yeah. Toilets. Where are the toilets? Ah, we might be able to get food over there. Relief supplies are being distributed. One per person, please. Ramen! Looks like they're giving it out over there. Sis, they've got instant ramen. <sighs> hey, Mirai. Oh. Kind 
of a big one just now, huh? Let's go someplace and catch our breath for now. What are those? Tents? No, they look like toilets. I'm going over there. We'll wait under these trees over here. For heaven's sake, she's stubborn. I'll give her that. open oh we're saved lucky talk about your super good timing right. hey no cutting wait your turn what the spot was open you saw there was a line behind you don't lie to me hey he cut in front of you too say something huh? hey don't hide behind that kid aren't you ashamed to be doing that in front of children how old are you anyway how the hell old are you, Don't pal? play that game with me! We're about to say! Let me go! You gotta follow the rules or not! Shut up, you son of a bitch! Can't get through? I hope you can get through to Hina soon, Mari. Yeah. By the way, you think Sergeant Snack Time is alright? Huh? What's wrong? M Mari. <gasps> uh <-huh. sighs> <laughs> Chocolate and MREs here. Chocolate and MREs. They're all mixed together. I'll take some ramen. Sorry. But this tent is out of instant ramen! Aww. That guy had two! Yeah, some grown-ups are like that. Even while they tell kids how to act. I'm sure he has a reason. Maybe he's taking it to someone who's hurt. A reason, right. Ow! 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 Mirai? Are you okay? Did you get burned? Nerve of that woman. She didn't even apologize. Here, Mirai, dear. Here. Here you go. Want me to hold it? No way! I said I was fine, didn't I? I heard they brought people in from Shinigawa. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, Sis! Nirai? You okay? What's uh, the deal? Uh, what is that? I think around here is where they're bringing people who have died. Hmm. Um, excuse me. Yes? Any word on how Sancha is doing? Sancha, huh? Any word from Sancha? Sorry, we don't have any reports in from there yet. <sighs> when will I get a call through? I wonder if the tree we planted is doing okay. Who cares about that? Stupid. I wonder if Dad and Mom are okay. I told you! I don't know! Even you should be able to understand that! Mirai? Yuki? 
Looks like our route home is pretty much okay. Uh, really? Really. <laughs> this is Shiba Park, where we are now. And over here is Shibuya. If we follow this straight, we'll get to my home in Sanjinjaya. After that, we follow Setagaya Street, then cut over here to Kenuda Park. From there, it's just a short hop to your home. So, for now, why don't you come with me to Sanjinjaya? And then it's a short hop to our house. Let's hit the road! Mm-hmm! And you'll give your best too, right, Mirai? Mm -hmm. Maybe your phone will get through when we get to the school. That makes no sense. I'm sure Yuki just means he hopes you'll get through. Isn't that right? Because you think then she'll be happy too, right? Okay then. All right. Once I get back from dumping our trash, we'll set out. Mm -hmm. It's like you and Mari are on the same wavelength. Huh? Is your stomach okay? I think so. Once we get back home, you can have more than just my pudding. Oh, for... Could you just stop talking about food, huh? Is your stomach still hurting, sis? Not really. Then what? We're almost home. <clears throat> I told you we're not almost home. Besides, uh, we don't even know if our house will be standing when we get there. Not to mention, I keep calling Mom and Dad, but I can't even get through. Well, maybe the cell phones... Uh, or maybe uh, they just don't care whether we're all right or not. I just can't take it anymore. Here. robot exhibit, we wouldn't even be in this mess. This is all your fault. I, I wanted to see it. I wanted to see the bridge. Because they said they weren't going to take us anywhere for summer vacation. So I thought you and me could go and see the bridge together. That was all. Where did he go? Oh! There you are! You two weren't where I left you, so I've been looking everywhere. I'm sorry. Did something happen? Where's Yuki? I... Hang on, I'll go look for him. Wait! Mirai! I'll be right back! It was a big one, huh? Oh, did another building fall down? Stop that, you're scaring me. <laughs> Yuki! 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 Yuki, 
Yuki! Yuki, come on! Jeez. Murray's back. Come on, let's go now. You don't understand, sis. You can see our house from Tokyo Tower. I know. But we know the way to get home now. So let's go back. We know the way back, but not if our house is okay. Even I can understand that much. And that's why I want to see how it is right now. If you see it's okay, then you can calm down, right, sis? I know I'll see our house, because we can see Tokyo Tower from home. So I know I'll... <laughs> sis, Mom and Dad aren't dead. <laughs> I miss Dad and Mom! Hmm. Hey kids, what's the matter? What's the matter? Well, looks like they're lost. Miss, are you two by yourselves? Where's your father? Or your mother? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make you cry. It's all right. We just haven't been able to get in touch. <laughs> we'll see you. Let's get home soon and give Mom her present, okay? Aside from that lump, are you okay, Yuki? Yeah. Honestly, you two. I was really worried. I'm sorry. Good. Glad the attitude's gone. So, that promise we made in Odaiba. From now on, we keep it, okay? Okay. Good. Then now we'll head to a shelter area at a middle school. Grab all our bags, won't you? Uh, why? Right now? We have to try and get there before sundown. Don't forget our promise. The three of us are going home together. Okay! Someone said that noise before was Tokyo Tower coming down. Seriously? What's 
What's wrong? <laughs> Tokyo Tower really did fall, didn't it? I could see it from my classroom. Tokyo Tower. Is that around here? Just what school is it that you go to, Mirai? It's Rika Girls Academy. Really? That's where the shelter area we're headed for is. What? No way, really? I'm impressed, Mirai. That's a prestigious school. No, I barely passed getting in. I heard it was renovated just recently. One of the municipal workers told me that was why the buildings in this area have so little damage. Yeah, the building construction is new, but it was designed to look old. Mom liked that about it, too. Hmm? Mom also said it was the school she wanted to go to. That's why she was so happy when Sis was accepted that Mom fell down. <laughs> she fell down? Mm-hmm. That was at the school's entrance ceremony. Mom! Stop tripping over nothing. You're embarrassing us. Ah. <laughs> Oh, ow. oh no! Now what do I do? Oh. It was her fault for wearing such high heels. That scrape looked like it really hurt. I don't care, but she was in such a bad mood after that. You know, she was probably just angry with herself as all. Doing something like that at her daughter's entrance ceremony. If it had been me, I probably would have cried. You're like her, aren't what? you? What? I'm not like her at all. No, you totally are. I'm totally not. Mommy has to go out. <laughs> <clears throat> Keep away from the school building, please. Somehow, doesn't seem like my school. Is there anyone who hasn't gotten water yet? Anyone who hasn't gotten water? You must be thirsty. Have some water. Oh, thank you. Have you been to the hospital yet? Yes, I went, but it's so crowded that there was no one to see him. There's lots of people here who are hurt, huh? There are a lot of hospitals located in this part of the city, Yuki. Looks like they're all full up, though. It's hard to believe... that you go to school here, Mirai. Yeah, but I feel like we've come to some place I've never seen before. That's not surprising. Still, we feel a lot better with you here since you know the place so well. Isn't that right? Mm-hmm. Besides, I always kind of wanted to come and see your school, sis. But it's a girls' school, so I figured they wouldn't let me in. You could come visit during the culture fair. Not like I'd invite huh? you. Hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah, Yuki. Mm -hmm. Come on, I'm gonna show you something cool. Huh? This way! Uh. <laughs> hey, sis! What's in here? Stained glass windows? Wait till you see, they're so pretty! <laughs> Look, over there!
Souffles. Megu mentioned it once that that her mom made her souffles. It's not like Megu and I were really close or anything. I I kind of disliked her actually, but but I hated seeing her that sad. I just hated it. <laughs> I couldn't do anything to help her. <laughs> what can any of us do? In the end, that is. It's been one day since the quake, but we've yet to receive detailed damage reports from all areas. However, according to the Tokyo Fire uh, Department, we've gotten word that 200,000 homes... Doesn't have been seem much fires. cooler. Even the though it's nighttime now. now. At over 2, 000, with over 80, people gravely yeah, injured. you're right. Large scale fires ignited in the city center but have I have a secret. Due to traffic I know of a place. A place that's a tiny bit cooler. This place is a little bit cooler thanks to the water. I can imagine you've been through a lot, but please, at least get some rest tonight. Pardon me, but who are you? My name is Furichi, and as you can see, I'm just an old man. I can't do very much to help, but at the very least, I can lead you someplace a little cooler. glass windows I wanted to show you, Yuki. They sparkled like this. So pretty. birthday cake, but I like the moon when it's round, like a big tasty pancake. I like crescent moons. I like the name. Oh, say, do you know this? Some people call the crescent moon a paper moon. Oh. Why? Don't know. <laughs> Nothing. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> it must be Mr. Furuichi. He's leading someone else over here.
major aftershock. Beware of fires, crumbling buildings, and any falling God, objects. how long is a this going to go on? It's just annoying now. And all surrounding areas. Was anyone injured? The window glass is cracked. Please, keep away from the school building. No! I can't take this anymore! We're okay. It's safe now. Big one, huh? Yeah. You two are so great. You're really holding up. No matter what, we keep our promise to each other. We won't get separated, okay? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Is there anyone here who's hurt? It seems Mr. Furuichi must be a local volunteer. We need to thank him. Ah, so here you are. Thank you so much for taking care of the children. Oh, it's nothing. You're not hurt? Uh, no, ma'am. It must have been frightening, but we're safe now. Your daddy and mommy will come for you soon. I know. Why don't I give you some candy? Grandma bought it for you. I know how much you like sweets. Here. Uh, th thank you very much. Uh... Here you go. Thank you! <laughs> you like those candies, don't you? Uh -huh. uh. Misako! Hello, dear. I want you to stay in the auditorium. It's safe in there. She's your wife? <laughs> she wasn't bothering you, was she? No, not at all. She gave me some yummy candy! <laughs> well, good for you. Enjoy it, please. Shall we go, dear? But, dear, the children... It's all right. They'll be safe here. Come along. Thank you. Are you all right? Yes. Are you hurt? We're fine. Now, come along, Misako. Hey, that old lady keeps calling us Chi and Ko. I wonder why. Hmm. Maybe. I think she's mistaken the two of you for her own grandchildren. Mr. Furuichi's grandchildren were killed in the quake yesterday. They apparently came for a surprise visit from the country. It must be so hard for him. But he's been all over, helping out here and there. He's an inspiration. If you need water or blankets, please come on over to the tents on the athletic field. We've been gathering them from here and there. Thank you very much. Oh, yes. 
Have you had anything to eat yet? We'll be having curry udon on the athletic field soon. All the terrible things that happened to everyone in this quake. I'm thankful. I truly am. Mm. What's wrong? Can't move? Not a bit. Me neither. There's something... You must be thirsty. How about some water? Thank you. I'd love some, Mr. Furuichi. You really are a lifesaver, despite all that's happened to everyone. No, no. This is all that I can do. <laughs> What's wrong? But, mister, after what happened to your grandkids... <laughs> you heard that. Yes. <laughs> They were my daughter's kids from Okayama. I hear they barely got any tremors in that part of the country. I just asked them to come visit. That's the most tragic part of it. They were actually just a little older than you and your brother are now. But to my wife, they'll always be little kids. I'm glad you're all okay. That's really good. It should have been me who died. I'd rather it be the young ones who live. <laughs> He's amazing, Mr. Furuichi. Makes me think I wasn't able to do anything for Megu. Mirai? Shall we go? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, sis, you have shoes now. 
nice, huh? I changed into my gym shoes. Yuki, are you okay with us leaving this early? I'm fine, but I think Sis will have trouble. Huh? Because you're like the king of the sleepyhead. You sleep until noon. What? That is so not true. I go to school, don't I? <laughs> hey, hey, come back here. If we walk up this street, we should come out at Azabu Juban, right? The place where I work is right around there. Oh, really? Yeah, I go there sometimes. There's a Nino Yaki store. I know that place. I go all the time. They're delicious when they're fresh out of the oven. We might have met even if the earthquake hadn't happened. <laughs> you two would have met at the Nino Yaki store someday, right? Then maybe I could have made friends with you. <laughs> Maybe. I think we would have. It's broken. Yeah, it is. Let's cross quickly. Mm -hmm. My aunt told me they built this place in the time she was gone on a school trip. Can you believe that? You're making that up. She said it's true. Really? You couldn't do that in three days and we'll two nights? <gasps> According to information received thus far, large-scale fires broke out in areas around Setagaya and Sanjinjaya stations immediately after the main quake. And he said Sanjinjaya. That's where Mari's house is, isn't it? It's pretty far from the, the station, fire. but... Next is Koenji. Tsunami Ward Koenji. <sighs> Here collapsed buildings, roof tiles, <sighs> Damn it. No good. <sighs> and now with the weather report. Embankments around the Arakawa area have collapsed due to the typhoon. Dock landing crafts from the United States 7th Fleet are moving in from Tokyo. What about Sancha? I know. Excuse me? Is anyone in here? <sighs> Damn it! I thought this phone might still be working. Um, I... I think you should get home as soon as you can. You can leave us if you want to. No way I could do that. <sighs> Sorry. I'm going to check out my office. I wonder if Hina's okay. Hmm. Come on.
Is it over? Yeah. Thanks, Mari. We can do. No. Thanks. It's okay. to go out for a while, but that they'd be back. Uh, of all the... Mari, you shouldn't... Uh, uh, Mari! Uh, you just need to rest. I'm fine. It's just anemia. Were those kids friends of yours? I met them in Odaiba, right after the quake hit. Our homes are in the same direction, so we were traveling together. Where did they say they were going? I don't know. They didn't tell me. They just left. I see. An extremely strong aftershock occurred at 12.05 p.m. today. We have yet to receive exact damage reports from all areas. Please keep away from any buildings that show damage from the quake, roadway subsidences, or ground fissures that you may see. There is a possibility that buildings and roadways Thank which you, appear Aya. undamaged may have been weakened. Oh the no, it's nothing. Have you been here the now whole time? Yeah, I couldn't contact anyone who was out on delivery, so I figured I'd wait till I get this place all cleaned up. 
<laughs> That's admirable. <laughs> it's nothing really. Look, I live by myself. It'd be hard for me to get home. Besides, I'm much safer here at the office than in that broken down apartment of mine, you know? Uh, yeah, tell me. Huh? Sorry, have you heard anything about how things are in St. Janjaya? It's burning, isn't it? I glimpsed some stuff about it on the news, but... I see. Yeah, you're right. Sorry I asked. It's okay. You're worried too, aren't you? Until I heard about because the fires, the loose, there is I thought Hina was safe with her grandmother. Are also That's what I told so myself, anyway. Nothing about Sancha, anywhere. Oh, yeah. Uh, You okay, Mari? Due to emergency Hina. Work by she loves having her picture teams. taken. She smiles so much when I do that I end up taking a ton of them without thinking. Look, you can't take on every little responsibility yourself. You are all that Hina has, okay? And you're worried about her too, I understand that. Highways are still mm. torn up from building collapses and other damage. So I... Now I promise to look after those two kids. To Please, just get home as fast operation. as you can. But You'll move a lot faster on your own. The damage already suffered. You should get home as soon as you can. The fires that started in the area around Sanjanjaya <laughs> Station immediately after the quake have burned for two nights and continue even now. It Mari. doesn't look like the fire department will be able to get the fires under control it's anytime on TV soon. Too. The damage zone from the fires that started around Sanganjaya Station have grown. The fire, the fire brigade, spreading. The rescue teams needed to Mari, the, blaze the guy from the bike shop will lend us one. I'll fire get one for you. So please, now, just go home. Go home. Please continue to watch and we'll keep you updated. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, Mari, you're bleeding. <sighs> Somebody give me a hand. You okay? Speak to me. Look for those two. Mari, I'll look for them. Please, just go home. Go home to Hina. Aya, stay here in the office. They may come back before I find them.
on ahead. I'm slow. After I invited you? What? I invited you. I can't very well ditch you, can I? Remember that at a time like this. That's right. I can't ditch them, can I? What do you think, sis? Will this bike go fast? I don't know. But it's faster than walking, right? After we get home, I want to go visit Mari. Hmm. You okay? Uh -huh. Let's hurry up and get this to Mari. Mm -hmm. Ready, set. Uh -huh. Mari! You two are dripping with sweat. Mari, look. We borrowed this. You can get home faster if you ride this bike. Thank you. And I'm sorry for worrying you, but... Let's take it back. Huh? Mm -hmm. But why? You can get home fast with this! Because all three of us can't ride this bike, right? <laughs> You'll be fine, because Mari's with you. I'm gonna stay here for a while. If anything happens, please come back. That includes you two, okay? Don't expect a welcome party, though. <laughs> uh, looks like it's going to rain today. Mari, are you sure about this? I know he was all right. She has my mother with yeah. You're right. I'm sure she's fine. We're currently using our robo cues and other search equipment in an all-out effort to locate survivors. We've already confirmed one survivor. How long until they can be rescued? He's buried under multiple sections of reinforced concrete over 20 centimeters thick. But it should be any moment now. We have Team 1 assisting with the rescue. Okay, we'll do our best and all get home, okay? Mm-hmm. Mari, are you okay now? Uh-huh. I'm all better now, thanks to you two. See for yourselves. Ow! 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 <laughs> what I tell ya. <laughs> Jeez. Now, we'll cut through Rapongi and come out in Shibuya. Right. right. I used to pass by here, coming home from school all the time. But it's like a different city now. Mm -hmm. Ah, <clears throat> uh, what's that? Hmm? Go in once the rebar on top of the pool. Robots. Huh? <laughs> okay, don't skip on the safety checks. Okay, go in from number two. Two five two survivor in need of aid. Sighted. He's conscious. <laughs> you okay? Huh? Speak to us. You okay? You all right? Can you tell us your name? Oh. 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 oh, 
You're drawing robots. Hmm? You draw them really good. <laughs> you like robots? Yeah, and I draw them all the time. Do you like drawing pictures too? Well, not pictures so much. I like robots. I'm taking down lots of notes so I can look them up later. You know about those? Huh? It's the first time they're being used in the field. Ah, I saw those at the exhibit! You too? Well, do you know what that one is? Huh? Yuki? Uh... Over there, see? They trace the arm movements from the control unit. Each arm can lift a ton. You know a lot about them, huh? Yeah. Someday, I want to build robots just like the ones over there. <laughs> What's it doing? Showing off since the job's done? You don't know anything, do you? It's double-checking to see if there are any other people who need help here. It's a lightweight robot, so the balance is bad when it walks. That robot's called a semi-autonomous type. After you enter the coordinates, it moves on its own. Well, I gotta get going now. Thanks a lot, big brother. My name's Kento. Kento Nonomiya. My name's Yuki Onizawa. I'm in third grade. Oh, huh? I'm in the seventh grade. Seventh grade? Just like my big sister. I hope I see you again. Sure, see ya. <clears throat> That's the type they call an otaku. A robotaku. Uh -huh. This earthquake is being called the greatest urban near-field earthquake ever observed in this nation. According to the Government Crisis Management Center, the death toll is estimated at 180,000, even higher than the 140,000 killed in the Great Kanto Earthquake of 1923. While the fires around the quake's epicenter are being extinguished, according to Tokyo Fire Department reports, 150,000 victims may still be threatened, with 200,000 injured. Although that number is no word on sunshine. Mari? Hmm? I'm okay. Thank you. of rats in this city, so... Uh, what? Yuki? Yuki? What's wrong? I'm okay. My head was just hurting a little, that's all. Oh, your head is burning up. Maybe it's heat stroke. Uh, wait in the shade. I'll go see if there's any medicine I can get. Okay. Look, tell us if you feel sick, okay? It'll be a lot of trouble if you start fainting on us. <laughs> Sorry. Jeez. Uh. <laughs> oh, it's Kento! What? Hey, keep still! I'm afraid this is all the municipal services people gave me. Thanks. It's a real help. Yuki! Uh, Mirai? What? What are you doing? Where are you going? Sorry! I'll be right back! Oh. Kento! Oh. Yuki! <sighs> Yuki! We 
three promised to stick together, right? Uh, Robotaku. Huh? <laughs> Sis, we saw those frog bots at the mirror icon, remember? <laughs> oh. Frog bots? Yeah, they do look like frogs, don't they? They're waterproof to 20 atmospheres or more. Waterproof to 20 atmospheres? Right. They can withstand the pressure of up to 200 meters below the surface. The question is, is whether it's necessary or not. Wow. Definitely otaku. Otaku? I mean, you know all this stuff about robots. Because <sighs> I like them. If it weren't for robots, my family might have died. Huh? That was back when I was in elementary school. I can see the survivors. Okay, don't use the scope. Proceed carefully. One and two. I need a power cutter and a spreader right now to get the door open. Roger! think they could have saved my whole family. That's why I want to design rescue robots like that someday, to help someone else. I'm sorry I called you an otaku before. <laughs> That's okay. After all, I do like robots a lot. Until that robot saved them, I always thought my parents and my big sister were annoying. But that night, I was really praying that I wouldn't lose them. <laughs> Do you two live around here? Uh-uh. We live near Canuda Park. I see. Well, I hope you get home soon. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Huh? For you, Yuki. I can have it? Sure. I've already memorized it. Uh, thank you! How are we going to explain this to Mari? God, I was really worried about you. Uh, I'm sorry. How do you feel? He's fine. You saw how he was running before. Mm, I'm fine. Why don't we rest for a while? Uh, uh, a frog baseball team. Huh? What are you talking about, Yuki? <laughs> it really is. Uh... It's raining. Yeah. I really appreciate it. No trouble at all. See you in a bit. He said he'd be back in 20 or 30 minutes. Let's rest a little till then, why don't we? <laughs> Found another one? Yeah. This place is full of frogs, huh? Mm-hmm. Maybe the owner really likes frogs, like you do. Sis? You're finished? Don't want it. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine. Maybe he caught a cold from sleeping outside. Uh. Oh no, sis! Oh. Yuki? Oh. Are you okay? I'm fine. I just ate too much. Mm. 
Get some sleep, okay? We're okay. It was just a little one. Looks like Mari even slept right through it. Mm. I was dreaming about the robot exhibit. You really like robots, don't you? But I think Kento's even more amazing. Cause he's a robotaku? He's a robot expert! Kento's the same age as me. But it's so great that he knows just what he wants to do. Know what? Mm -hmm. Up till now, all I've done is complain about Dad and Mom, you know? But they've actually done all sorts of things for us, haven't they? All I ever thought about were the bad things. And now, I realize how much I don't want them to die. When we get home, Let's be a little nicer to them, okay? Yeah. I hope we can all be nice to each other. Yeah. Let's throw Mom another birthday party. It'll be a surprise party. And we'll buy her a round cake. Yeah. Hey, uh, sis? Hmm? The reason I wanted to go to Odaiba was because I wanted us to see the bridge together. Yeah, you told me that back in Sheba Park. I did? <laughs> well, we were arguing, so... Uh, next time, let's all of us go back to Odaiba. Sure thing. Except the bridge is gone now. They'll build a new one. <laughs> uh, Yuki. My frog bot one! Hey, wait, where are you going? Just to watch the robots! Huh? Back to Mari. What? Yuki, did you really see Kento there? Uh huh. See, there's nobody here. We can't go in anyway. Let's go back, Yuki. Ah, sis, up there, look! What's he doing up there? Kento! What are you doing? That's dangerous! The robot's leg is caught in some debris. Keep away from here. Huh? You're the one who needs to get away from there. What's he doing now? <laughs> Yuki, go get Mari. Uh, uh. Oh. I already called for one, you dope! Kento, reach out your hand! Take this! Let it go! Just leave it already! 
Thanks. You're pretty strong, aren't you? Huh? Okay, I'll go up top and pull you up. Close one, huh? That was a little more than close. Whose fault was this? Any? Oh, you're hurt. Are you in danger? Don't move. We'll be right up there. Concentrate search on the area where the scatter sign was strongest. We use these robots to avoid secondary disasters. Just hang Which in is there. rendered pointless if you go and get you yourself okay, hurt. So You're both there. old enough to know better. Now don't pull a damn fool stunt like that again. Okay, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Vital Personnel or equipment, any problems? No, no sir. sir. Okay, next one. Captain, once he's Mirai, patched up, we'll need an ambulance for I'm transport. I'm sorry for putting you in Take danger like it. that. And for saving me. Thank you. That's okay. There was nothing. Cuz this is brave, huh? There was nothing brave about this, for heaven's sake. What did you plan to do if things went wrong, huh? I'm sorry. Kento, please tell me more about robots next time. <laughs> I'll see you again. I promise. Okay, shall we go? Uh-huh. I went. I was thinking how cool you were, sis. Next time there's a robot exposition in Tokyo, let's all go together. Dad and Mom and you! And Kento, too! Hmm. Mirai! Hey, Yuki! Shall we go? Mm -hmm. to get him to a hospital. I'll get someone to help. Stay here. Mori! Stay with him. You're his big sister, right? I'll be back soon.
It's not true. It's not true. It's not true. Mirai. Mirai. Mirai, are you okay? Mari. Does your brother have any drug allergies? No, ma'am. Has he ever been hospitalized with a major illness or injury? No, ma'am. Thank you very much. Supposed to wait. How are you, Jude? Please. <laughs> Yuki, he won't die, right? I'm sure he'll be all right. You saw how he was running around before. Yeah, you're right. Yuki can't die. Doctor, over here, please. Vitals? He has no pulse, and there's no respiration. Yuki, sis is here. I'm right here. I'm impressed, Mirai. You're not falling apart. Well, that's... Yuki will be okay. He's just a little tired. He just got sick. He has to be okay. Yuki... Don't give up. Sis! 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 Sis is here. I'm here. Doctor. What? Why?
Yuki? Did I fall asleep or something? running around just because you feel better. But it's okay, really. The doctor said I was perfectly fine now. No, it's uh, not okay. Uh, you still have to rest, you know. And making such a big deal about you giving me an IV. Uh, well, from now on, you stick to my side, okay? Okay. Honestly. It's all your fault. I had that totally weird dream. A dream? Hmm. They took you in for emergency surgery. It didn't work, and you died. <laughs> you have all sorts of weird dreams, sis. I hear you go, ah, uh, in your sleep in the middle of the night. <laughs> Do I? <laughs> yeah, I heard you talk in your sleep a bunch of times about all sorts of things. What? You sure you weren't just half asleep yourself? I was not. I heard it plain as day. I've had it. I really had it. <laughs> right, right. Guess I'm a sleep talker, too. You can like, giggle all day long. Come on, it's time we got back to where Mari is. Mm -hmm. You don't hurt now? Uh-uh. Got a puke? I'm fine. Really? Really, really. So hey, let's get home as quick as we can. I bet Mari's really worried about Hina. You're right. Let's get home fast. But if you feel even a little sick again, you tell me. I want to know immediately. You got that? Mm-hmm. Gotcha. I'm starting to think you're a little spoiled. Huh? You think so? Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Dad. Junko and Kanai and I are all fine. If you get this message, please just leave me a voicemail. Uh, yes, okay? my name is Mari Kusakabe. With the possibility for landslides. Tsunamis are also feared, so citizens are advised to stay away from the coast and all riverfront areas. Now, at the fire in Sanganjaya, we go to our live reporter, Yuki Ogasawara. Yuki, tell us what's happening over there, if you would. Right. This is Yuki Ogasawara. The fire which started in Sanganjaya and grew so large it threatened Setagaya Ward has finally been extinguished after burning for four days. However, the fire which centered in the commercial district in front of the railway station spread to consume one section of the residential area. A large number of people have been left homeless. Great damage occurred to the shopping arcade running along the commercial district. On the other hand, the residential area didn't suffer nearly as much damage. And thanks to evacuation orders being issued early on, most residents were able to get to sheltered areas at the elementary school and the park before the blaze became too bad. Kusakabe? According to the fire department, 40 bodies Ms. have been Mari recovered Kusakabe? with... Wait, yes. It looks like they've just I've just finished filling else. out all of the necessary I forms for you. I hope they're all right. Yes, I can Thank see another one. Thank you Here are copies for you I to keep. I wonder if she's okay. <sighs> Mirai? I accidentally ended up washing my face with toothpaste. Uh, Mari! Oh, Mari. Sorry, I went for a walk on my own. I didn't see Yuki when I woke up this morning, so I went looking for him. 
<laughs> he was worried for a while, but he seems okay now. Mari, we really need to hurry up and get you home to Hina. I'm sorry if I worry you. robot exhibit, the crackers and water, and the present we got for mom, too. And the bank with my money in it. Jeez. Yuki, you need to keep your money in a wallet. It's heavy carrying it around in this thing. It's not heavy. I'm a man. And I'm stronger than you, sis. <laughs> no, you're not. Anyway, you've been lugging this thing around all this time. You should have asked me for help. Mari, did you hear something about Sanjin Jaya at the hospital? Mm. It seems the fire's been put out, but it got pretty big before they did. But only one of the residential areas burned. Most of the people evacuated to the elementary school, so maybe... Mirai. Yes? I left a voicemail for your parents. Oh, they... they had that, dear? I wonder if they'll get it. I'm sorry. As soon as we get to Sancha, I'll get you home. We can take care of Yuki later. That's okay. I understand. He seems okay now, right? But he needs a real examination later. He hides it when he's sick. I'll have to keep a close eye on him. So, you don't have to worry about it, Mari. I can take care of my little brother just fine. weren't hurt in the quake. Birds must have just flown away. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. Yuki? Huh? I'm sure Mom and Dad are fine. I mean, we're okay, so I know they're okay, too. They're waiting for us to come home. <laughs> If we could fly like birds, then we could be home in a snap, couldn't we? <laughs> You're right, but we're almost home. So, let's keep walking. I promise I'm gonna bring you home. Does the way back look like it's okay? Mm-hmm. Once we're through the park, we'll take Ibisu Street to Yamate Avenue. Right. I'll bet Hina and your mom can't wait for you to get home and hug them. And then you and I and Hina and your mom will all have dinner tonight. Doesn't that sound like fun? So let's hurry up and get back home, okay? Mariah. 
I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I... Come on, Mari. Let's go. Everyone's waiting. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Hey, what's the matter? No, it's nothing. Want me to carry that bag? It's heavy, isn't it? I'm fine. Yuki could carry it. Besides, I want to. I'm his big sister. Machine's so cool. Look at how much it can lift. Oh yeah. Why don't you become a Robotaku like Kento and me, sis? <laughs> It'd be fun. <laughs> I'll think about it. What is it? Oh, nothing. Just thinking about how amazing robots are. Bit by bit, they're bringing things back to normal, aren't they? Ooh. Sanjinjaya. Let's see. Maybe three kilometers? I think we should reach it in about an hour. Let me check in on the news. And we have reports in. The fires that devastated the area around Saginjaya Station and Setagaya Ward are more or less extinguished across the whole area. Amidst the anxiety caused by successive aftershocks and secondary disasters, Fire brigades and self-defense personnel risk their lives as they continue search and rescue efforts in the heart of the area. Meanwhile, in Suginami... Looks like the fires are out in Sancha, but... Let's keep moving as fast as we can. Quicker to just go there than to worry about it. I'm sorry to make you hurry like this. <laughs> Confirm the identity of these remains. Oh, screw you! I'm supposed to leave my daughter in a place like this? Think a little before you say stuff like that. How is this? This isn't what they said on the news at all. No! 
sorry. <gasps> Mrs. Yamachi! It was awful. My grandfather didn't make it out in time either. Either? You mean Hina and my mother? This whole area was an inferno. There was no way to get out once the fire started. There were so many old houses here that people were just buried alive. <gasps> me what happened to the people living here oh you mean around here well with so many gas stations exploding I hear they all got blown up I went out to work my part-time job I left grandpa all alone What do we do? This is our fault. Mari could have gotten home sooner if it wasn't for us. Come on, let's look around a little more for Hina and her grandma. Hmm? Okay, sis, please. people who lived in the Kusakabe house? Can't help you. We're actually from the countryside. But the folks around here seem to have evacuated to Kamayuma Elementary School. The word is a lot of people got caught in the fires that started around here. They set the school up as a morgue, so that may be the place to check for now. It's a terrible thing, but that's where they took them. Let's go see. But we... Hmm. Mari, listen. A volunteer told me the people around here evacuated to Kamiyuma Elementary School. And also... <gasps> that they've set up a morgue there. Excuse me, hmm? I'm looking for Kusakabe from Kamiyuma Block 2. A four-year-old girl and an older woman. Kamiyuma Block 2, huh? <sighs> Kamiyuma Block 2. We have an unidentified woman in her 50s and a four-year-old girl. Are you part of their family?
That's her there. You're with the family, young lady? <gasps> if you don't mind, would you please confirm their identities? Confirm that it's them, please let us know. Sis? Hmm? I think Hina and her grandma are still alive. Don't be ridiculous, Yuki. I still think we should look some more before we give up! Please, sis. We just got here. There are other places to check, right? Besides, the gas station near them didn't burn down. They must still be alive. Hmm. Come on! Yuki, wait! the kindergarten next door. Take a right out the main gate and it's a short walk. Thank you very much. Okay, everyone, settle down. We're gonna read a story. Hina! Hina Kusukabe! shelter, but she said she was going home and she never came back. Uh, why not? Pardon, excuse me. Yes? Is there a Reiko Kusakabe in this hospital? <laughs> that doctor today was a real hunk, wasn't he? <laughs> Mother! <laughs> really? Oh, Mar, you're all right. Grandma! Forgive me, Hina. Mother. You hardly got a scratch. Thank goodness. Oh, 
Oh, thank goodness. I'm sorry if I worried you. I really didn't mean to. As you should be. What were you thinking going back to the house? Well, that's where your and Hina's clothes are, right? It's been so hot and I couldn't stand seeing her get a heat rash. Oh, for... In the middle of all this, you worry about a heat rash? Well, you know. Oh, that reminds me. Look, that bundle there. <laughs> <laughs> Those are important things. I had to get them back. Let's wait around the corner. Mm -hmm. Nice ending, huh, for Mari? Mm-hmm. Stretcher coming through! Be my mother's nurse? Yes. In this situation, if we don't ask relatives to do it, we wouldn't have enough nurses. If you could, please. Sis, I... Hey, Sis, listen. Let's go. Huh? You want to get home soon, too, don't you? Mm-hmm. Mari? It's time for us to go home now. Huh? Yuki told me he really misses Dad and Mom. Wait. Uh, I promised I'd see you home. Just wait a little. Miss Kuzukabe? Uh, Miss Kuzukabe, I'd like to change your mother's bandages. Would you give me a hand, please? Right. Coming. Wait here. I'll be right back. I told Mari we're going. Mm hmm Once things settle down, I'm sure we'll see her again. Mm hmm Come on. So, we're to deliver the patients to Seijo Academy, right? Please. Excuse me! Pardon me! Huh? I live near Seiju Academy. Could you give me a lift? This truck is for transporting casualties, so, uh... Your legs hurt, isn't it? Uh, yes? Then get in. We're about to leave. Oh, um, sorry, but can you wait just a minute? I'll be right back. Sure. Mommy! <laughs> that girl told me to give this to you. Dear Mari, thank you so much for all you've done. I don't think we would have gotten this far if it hadn't been for you. I'm really glad Hina and her mom are all right. I got a ride on a truck headed for Seiju. Forgive me for leaving without telling you, but I promise once things have settled down, Yuki and I will come visit you together. I'll never forget you, Mari. Oh, Mirai. Together? Do you need to throw up? What's wrong? Are you sick or something? Then what? Sis, I am... Uh, listen. What is it? Listen. What's the matter? Just tell me. Listen. Just suppose... If I... If I died... What would you do? Uh, uh, That's 
ridiculous. Don't say stupid things like that. If you died, Dad and Mom would cry themselves to death. So would I. So please, don't talk about dying anymore, okay? <sighs> Sorry. Anyway, when we get home, let's tell Dad and Mom about everything that happened to us, right? I'll tell them how you were really strong the whole time. Don't worry. I'll tell them how strong you were too, sis. You were cool. And we have to give Mom her birthday present. I'll tell her that you picked it out. Well, sis, not much farther and then we'll be home, won't we? Mm-hmm. Listen, Yuki. Huh? Summer break's only just started, you know. Once things settle down a bit, let's do nothing but have fun. Last year, I was so busy studying, I didn't have any fun. <laughs> I envied you then, because you didn't have any exams that you had to go and take. But it was boring for you, too, not having me take you anywhere, huh? Uh-uh. I played with Itsuki. Besides, Sometimes you drew me pictures of frogs, and I liked that. It was fun. What? Those terrible pictures? They weren't terrible. <laughs> yes, they were. They were cute. <laughs> You're so weird. <laughs> Now be gentle when you touch him. <laughs> hey, let's come back here together. Uh-huh. Yuki, we're almost there. Uh-huh. Isn't that your friend's place, Yuki? Yeah, Kazu's house. I hope our house is okay. She said you and your little brother went off to Odaiba by yourself, and that she couldn't reach you at all. I see. So Dad and Mom are all right. Uh-huh. She said your dad got hurt at his office, but it's nothing serious. Your mom's been going crazy worrying about you two. <laughs> Thanks for telling me. Is everyone at your house okay? <laughs> yeah, they're fine. Everyone's at home, but my mom... She's in the last month of her pregnancy, so we brought her here just to be safe. Thank goodness they're all right. Yeah, except I still haven't gotten in touch with Yuka. I don't know what's happened to anyone else in our class. Mm. I ran into Megu the day before yesterday. <gasps> but it looked like her mom had died. <laughs> what do you think? What happened now, Mirai? I wonder if school will start when it should. Mm. Uh, by, by the way, where's your little brother? 
Uh, huh? Well, he was right here a minute ago. Oh. Anyway, I'm glad you're both okay. You should hurry up and get to the elementary school and see your mom. Hmm. <laughs> Why things settle mom. down? I'll come and see how you're doing. <laughs> Why you little? <laughs> <laughs> come back here, you little brats! <laughs> Yuki. <laughs> I told you not to run off! <laughs> oh, come on, Yuki. Where are you running off to now? To the school! <laughs> Yuki! <laughs> I said wait! <laughs> oh, man. Oh. <clears throat> oh. Hey, Ski. Oh, the Selfonian. That's not my name. Didn't I tell you I'm Mirai, remember? Mirai. Yep. Hey, Itsuki? Hmm? Did you see Yuki? I just saw him run through the gate. Yuki? He's here? Yeah. We heard our mom was here. Well, maybe he went over to the gym. That's where your mom and everyone are taking shelter. Oh. Is your family all right, Itsuki? Yeah, but our house is wrecked. Oh, really? Hmm. So, do you know where my mom is? Over there! <sighs> Looks like she's out. <laughs> mom? Where's Yuki's mom? Why? Is something wrong? She just left to get some fresh clothes from home. I heard your dad is still in the hospital, so he couldn't go himself. The hospital? But they say it's not serious. It looks like he's okay. Oh. Your mom really has been worried sick about you. You should let her see you're okay as soon as you can. You still might be able to catch up. Go after her. Okay, I'll go home just as soon as I find Yuki. Thank you very much. Yuki! Yuki! Hmm. We can try the athletic field next. Has it grown a little? I feel like I haven't seen it in ages. Maybe if we wait here, Yuki will come. Oh, yeah. Yuki. Yuki? Yuki! Huh? Oh, that's stupid! I, huh? <laughs> Wait for me! to give Yuki our Marinier journal. Marinier journal? Yeah, it's an exchange journal. It was Yuki's turn to write in it. You two were doing that? Yeah. Yuki said we should both write in it when we started. Yuki! Yuki? Yuki? Yuki! Yuki!
Darn it, Yuki. Why did you just run off like that? I was looking for you. Yeah, sorry about that, sis. Yuki? <gasps> Yuki? Oh, found him? Mm-hmm. Yuki, Itsuki was also... What the... Did he go to the toilet? That toilet's dirty. I mean, it's really gross. This is our classroom. Here's my seat, and this one's Yuki's. <laughs> They're so little. Were the desks always this small and cute? And look at all the doodles he made. Oh, Yuki. Goodness. And over here, they hung the pictures we drew on the bulletin board. Look! That's Yuki's picture. In first grade, my family crossed the bridge to Odaiba. It was lots of fun. Yuki Onozawa. Yuki. Yuki told me that he wanted to go back to the bridge with everyone. The reason I wanted to go to Odaiba was because I wanted us to see the bridge together. Why am I... Huh? Mirai? It's strange. What's wrong with me? Um, I'll go look for Yuki. <laughs> Why? Why am I crying? Cry. I'm right here beside you. Yuki? <laughs> Darn it, next time you run off, I'm gonna get really mad! Elementary school kids are good at calligraphy these days. Can you tell which one's mine? Let's see. Ha! Found it. <laughs> it's good, huh? It's too big. But I can tell you put a lot of work into it. I can tell. Because I'm your sister. Yeah, I worked hard because I love your name, sis. <laughs> Yuki wasn't in the toilet. Yeah, sorry. He's right here. He was just here, sitting on this desk. Well, he never could keep still. He, always running around, all over. Getting lost. <sighs> uh, sorry. I'm gonna go get our Mariniere journal. My house is right near here. Uh, wait, I'll, I'll go with you. I'm going to go find my mom. Okay, but... I'm sorry. Uh, I'm okay now. Let's go. Mm. Time. It's dangerous! Come out! It's fine. I came here this morning, too. Where's Yuki? Sis! I'll go get Itsuki! Yuki, no! Come back! Oh, you little... <sighs> Itsuki! That's enough! Come down! Almost got it! Found it! Here you go. Would you give it to Yuki for me? Mm-hmm. July 20th, planted the marionaire with Itsuki. Sis?
just called the marionaire macaroni. I think it's because she likes to eat. <laughs> what is this? He made that all up. Thanks a lot, Itsuki. I'll make sure he gets it right away. Sure. Uh, Yuki? Huh? Oh, where did you go? You told me you were going to call Itsuki. What were you doing? Come on, let's go home. That means you too, Itsuki. You have to get back to the shelter, right? Um, yeah. Uh. <laughs> Itsuki! Come on! Uh. Yuki! Yuki! Oh, Hitsuki! Hitsuki, <gasps> are you okay? Yuki, are you... Sis, I... Yuki? Yourself? My house is close, so maybe you should wait at the school. I'll go find her. I can't go home. Not by myself. Without Yuki. Dad and Mom will be so sad. Why, Yuki? Listen. I am... I died. Yuki. Keep... 
Yuki? Let's go home. Hey, Yuki. Hmm? Yuki, you're... You're gone now. But you're so kind that you're staying with me so that I won't be sad, aren't you? I just want to be with you, sis. And I wanted us to go home together. You keep... Let's go home. I promised to bring you home, didn't I? Yuki, we're finally home. Uh-huh. Hey, look. Mom might be here. Sis? Thanks a lot. Yuki? No, you can't. Yuki, please don't go away. I have to go. What? What did you say? Sorry, I can't hear you. I can't hear you, Yuki. Don't go. <laughs> Don't leave me. <laughs> hey, sis. I love you. Mirai. off on your own no you're wrong it was because we were arguing that's why Yuki was Mirai <laughs> thank you for being with Yuki to the end <laughs> Yuki was with me the whole way right till I made it home 
so that I wouldn't be sad, so that I wouldn't stop, so that I would make it home. He never left my side. That's why I made it home, thanks to Yuki. He kept telling me how much he wanted to tell Dad and Mom when we got home. How he wanted us all to go to Odaiba, to go to Grandpa's. He wanted us all to go together. You know, he wanted us all to hold hands as a family and cross the bridge. Yuki kept telling me over and over, Let's go home. Yuki! 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 Where's Mirai? I still can't get her out of bed. I see. Yuki. I drew you a frog! Maybe you should stop doing that. Yeah. Food's ready, Mirai. Why don't you join us? Mm. It's been one month since the northern Tokyo Bay earthquake, and little by little, the metropolitan area is regaining some sense of normalcy. Hmm. However, many areas still remain without essential utilities, and... Hmm. With all the commotion we've had, I can't believe it's the end of August now. Is it really? Huh? Yes! Coming! How do you do? My name's Kusukabe. You're Mari, aren't you? Yes. Forgive me. I should have come sooner. No, forgive me. I was the one who called you out here like this. I think she'll be happy to see you. So, where's Mirai? Mirai? Mari? Have you gotten a little thinner? I don't know, have I? I've been eating all right, I guess. It's not that. It's so bright out, except you feel like you're suffocating. Morning comes, the sun rises. You see everyone around you looking so happy, and it's like you're in a daze. 
when my husband died, when he suddenly vanished right before my eyes, that's how it felt. I don't remember anything about the funeral. How did I even manage to breathe through all that? But there was Hina, growing day after day, laughing, learning to talk, sneezing in a way like my husband did. You and Yuki were so much alike. You think so? Mm-hmm. Yuki's still alive inside of you. Oh, yeah. Here you go. And also, here. Sorry, I took so long. But I thought I threw it away. Yuki picked it up and brought it along. Yuka's okay. Oh. Hey, look, there's one from you. Huh? Yuki? <sighs> Dear sis, I picked up your phone. You're a cell phoneian, so I figured you'd miss it. I want a cell phone too. <laughs> then I can send a ton of emails to you. That way, even when you can't talk much, we can still have fun. And I want to take pictures, too. Let's get home soon and give Mom a present and then take a picture of it. So let's try hard and keep walking from Yuki. Yuki. Mirai. Yuki. He really did try hard, didn't he? His head must have been hurting him so much. Mm -hmm. He must have felt sick all that time. But he kept walking and never complained. <laughs> Even with all that food he hated to eat. <laughs> Eating all that hard bread. He was so brave. Mm -hmm. He really, really tried so hard. What do I do? Yuki's gone now. I miss him so much. <laughs> <laughs> Should I call Marai? When she said goodbye to Mari, she smiled and promised that she'd visit her, but... She just needs some time. Don't push yourself too hard, dear. Or you, honey. Mirai. Uh -uh. Are you hungry? Or maybe you want something to drink? Mama, I know this is really late, but happy birthday. <gasps> Yuki picked it out. Because you like flowers, he said. And there's also this. It says, to mom from Yuki. Oh, I just love it. Look at this, honey. Yeah, it looks just like you and Mirai. And you? <laughs> really? Does my face really look like that? <laughs> Dear Yuki, so much of you still remains in this house. When I'm asleep, when I'm awake, no matter what I do, I'm reminded of you. I'll probably always be sad, 
it'll probably always hurt. So, if the sadness and the pain ever gets too much for me to bear, I'll tell you about it and not hold back. I'll tell you about the happy times and the fun times, too. You'll hear every little detail. Yuki, thank you for being born as my little brother. Moving forward. Yuki's watching. I'm not afraid.